Polymaker are no longer producing plastic spools, instead switching all filament onto 100% recycled cardboard spools. This means that thousands of kilograms of plastic waste will be saved from landfill each year and no new trees will be cut down to create the spools as they are sourced from 100% recycled cardboard. Since launching Polyterra PLA in February, we received many compliments from our customers praising the cardboard spool and the recyclable packaging. People really like the feel of the spool, the thick cardboard outer face which allows the spool to roll freely when mounted internally or externally on every design of spool holder. The outer face is 4mm thick, rolled and die cut solid cardboard which provides a strong spool with no compromises on quality or printability. The biggest challenge for us when developing the new spool was finding a naturally sourced glue that can withstand temperatures of 100 degrees centigrade. As our nylons, PVA and other materials are hygroscopic, it was important for us to provide a spool which can be oven dried at high temperatures for long periods of time without losing the structural integrity of the spool. We developed this glue in our labs especially for our new spools and its performance is outstanding in terms of strength and heat resistance. The spools can be dropped from a higher height than the old plastic spools without breaking, providing you not only with a more robust product, but also a more environmentally friendly product. Of course, the best part about the new spools is their afterlife. Once you have finished your spool, you can easily rip apart the cardboard faces from the inner tube and toss them straight into the paper recycling. We have also redesigned the outer box with a larger label with clear information about filament diameter, colour and key features. On the spool you will find a QR code which takes you to the product information page on polymaker.com. We have removed any unnecessary paper from inside the box with the basic printing settings printed directly onto the spool. This leaves you with only the spool and the outer box to recycle after use. We think that plastic is a fantastic material and 3D printing is the best application for it. That being said, we shouldn't waste this resource. We should value it for its potential to make our lives better and if we can improve the world around us at the same time, then switching to cardboard spools is clearly a no-brainer for us and for you. When will you make the switch?